Hello, all of my arms. It's Sinu here, and I'm back with some more The Crooked Man. And to start off, I want to thank all of you out there, all of you yawns, because you've helped out a lot in the comments who were saying, like, how I should proceed. And lots of you said the wires are what I needed to go by, the wires that were on the teacher's desk spelling out numbers. Can you spell numbers? It doesn't matter, I spell numbers. So they spelled out the numbers, uh, Caleb Duran commented saying that they spelled out 10101111, which of course, it's binary, and I brought up the binary thing on the game. Sorry, I have the mouse like zooming around, I tend to do that. And yeah, so thank you very much for that help, and we will go ahead and get continued. So if it's 10, that's 2, 101, that's 5, and 1111 is 15, so 2515. Let's go ahead and try this out. Wrong thing. So, two, five, one, five. Ba ba da bum. It contained the key to the reference room. I wonder where we're supposed to go now. Alright, let's see. Reference room. Reference room. Where's the fucking reference room? How about you? Cindy Peterson. Is that like French for reference room? I don't think so. <clears throat> Alright, so I'm guessing the reference room is down a floor. Okay, what's happening? <gasps> Did he just trip down the stairs? Ow. Ow. Hey, who was that? Whoa. Who'd you be? What are you doing in this school, you shady punk? Sh shady punk? I'm just looking for someone. You showed me out of you shoved me out of the blue. Who are you? Give me a name, or I'm calling the police on you. I don't know why he's got such like a weird deep voice, but it just sort of happened. I guess because his first sentence wasn't very well put together. I don't know. David Hoover. I'm looking for a guy I think was here. I'm not a robber or anything. Hmm, you sure? As if a robber would say they were one. God, why don't you make sentences right? W what do you want? A permit? Now you tell me who you are, or if you're going to ask me. I kind of messed up that. I'm D. I graduated from this school, so I came to bring back some memories. D? That's your name? Not actually the oddest one I've heard, but are you making fun of Sissy again? It's a nickname, dummy. You think I'd tell some shady guy my real name? Pfft. What a little brat. But I guess you ain't stolen nothing yet. Anything yet? I'm just wondering, so don't mind me. Smell ya. Oh my god, it's Gary Oak! What the hell's his problem? didn't even apologize. He pisses me off. Did you even see his girth? God. Alright, let's see. Reference room, that's what it was. I'm sorry, I was really enjoying doing that voice. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed it too. He just, he definitely fit the character for that voice though. Saying his nickname was D, not able to say his first sentence, and then like, messing up other sentences and saying like, um, don't, I, I don't even remember what it was. Thanks, Smellia. I don't know. But it makes sense. They say that people despise those who think similarly to them, or who are in similar situ circumstances. But humans are curious in that they can hide any outward appearance of goodwill or hatred. Though they are too faced deep down, they can make that idea seem unthinkable. You may despise someone much like you, but you may in your heart have affection for them. The improbable is not possible. I'm sorry, I completely messed that up. The improbable is not impossible. I never understood this philosophy stuff. Wouldn't you just dislike dislike people you don't like? I almost said dyslexia, which is something that I should probably get checked out, because I might have it. Not really, but I can't seem to read lately. Books on international law. Books on international law. Criminology. Criminology. Legal history. Civil law, philosophy of law, civil law, criminal law, criminal law, criminal law, criminal law, criminal law. 
A record of books checked in and out. Announcements of new arrivals and the like. Whoa. George Worth, 1726-1806. A signatory of the Declaration of Independence. He is sometimes called the father of American law for teaching the first classes in jurisprudence. Okay. He has a health bar under him, too. It's attached to the wall, but the screw's a little loose. If I have the right tool, I could unscrew it. Guess what, bro? You got the right tool. I knew I needed this screwdriver. Unscrew the screw holding the portrait. There's writing behind this. 1647? Is it a code for something? 1647. Glad I took the screwdriver, though I'm not sure it'll be useful again. Better switch it out with- wait, what's that? I guess there's a chair there and I can't get by. Books on comparative jurisprudence. So what was it, 1647? Let's check it again to be safe. 1647. I didn't even- okay, yeah. I didn't even read it. I was just like, yeah, it's, it's 1647. Don't even need to see. The shelves on the basement are for staff only. Those who require books from the basement must sign a form and be accompanied by staff. Taking any materials out is prohibited. Don't worry, got staff with me. It's a fire staff. Uh, an elevator for carrying books to the basement. There's no power, so it doesn't work. Oh well. I'll come back later with nice stuff. 1647. We need to figure out where that goes. And we also need to switch out. See, look! 101011. One, 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 one. Sixteen, forty-seven. Oh. Oh, that's not it. Yeah, I'm pretty sure they're all upstairs, aren't they? Going, going upstairs. Gonna find a lockbox that needs a four-digit key. A four-digit key. Please be the one. A security box that requires a passcode. Are you gonna let me put it in? That would be nice. Maybe I have to put it in from behind the side. Oh, that sounded terrible. I am so sorry. It's because your minds are sick. Polluted. Where are we going? There's one here. Security box that requires a passcode. Doesn't let me put it in, though. Don't know what I'm supposed to do. Six digit pen, 1647. Oh, here we go. Thank you so much. So glad. 1647. For a second I was gonna say, I don't know what we're gonna do next. I don't know where this code goes. It contained the key to the lecture hallway. I know what that is, that's on the- <gasps> God. <gasps> Honestly, I don't think I needed to do his reaction because I think mine was good enough. It was very real and genuine and pure and kind of hurt my throat. Wh what? Oh! Why? Why is it here? Oh my god, when did I last save? Back in the hotel. I... I thought I killed it. See, this is why I tried to save off and everybody. Damn it. I'll think about it later. I gotta... gotta run. Do what you want. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Running. Yeah. This is why I save often. Don't know if you, uh, ever experienced this type of thing. Probably have, playing with me, but, you know. Yeah. Have I already checked out the reference land place? No, I haven't, because the last thing I did was talk to D. Yo, dog, I'm D. You ever heard of a place called So and So Land? That's why I like to chill, cause I'm D. Sorry, I just really like doing that voice, it's fun. Probably like, changes every time I do it, just like everything else, but you know, it's okay. Gonna use the screwdriver, like it's just a tool. See what I did there? Such a terrible joke. boom, 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 so we should save now. Did I even? Yes, I did. Okay. 
I was gonna say, did I even actually use the screwdriver on it? But I think I did. All right, we're gonna save again when we're in here and about to be wrong one, about to be leaving. But first, we're gonna figure out what the course of action probably is. Can I go out the window? I don't think I can. Can I hide in the trash can? Trash can's overflowing. I don't wait. Where's my lighter? I guess I could try that, but I don't think that's gonna work. Like when he comes in, starts chasing, you use the lighter on the trash can. I don't know, because last time we used fire on him. But we'll see. Alright, so 1647 it is. That really scared me the first time that I went through that. And I don't know, you're just like... Oh, I know where that is! All I have to do is go... <laughs> Something like that. Alright, are you ready? I still don't know how I'm going to get around it. Can I, like, pick up the notebook and... Maybe it's a death note. Maybe I'm supposed to write the crooked man in there and run around for 40 seconds. Alright, are you ready? Because I'm not. Boom! Okay. Let's see what I can do. I'm gonna try to light that trash can on fire, and I'm really gonna hope it works. Ho, 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 ho. Not working, not working, not working. Still not working, still not working, still not working. Running, I'm dead, I'm dead. Yeah, that that's not the way to do things. It's not the way to do things at all. Um, there has to be something in the room to do. Definitely isn't something where you leave the room. Unless I'm supposed to, like, frame perfect leaving the room and getting into another room. Maybe I am. I don't know. We're just gonna get going. Try again. Maybe I actually can't get out that window? I don't think so. Maybe I can hide inside that box? No, not gonna, not gonna do it. Oh my god, every single time. Like, I guess it, I'm expecting there to be lag. I just hold down the down, 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 down. I'm sorry if this is bothering you seeing me do this over and over again. Uh, I feel like I've tried everything in here. I'm gonna try to frame perfect running out and getting into another. <laughs> wrong thing, wrong thing. Nope, so it doesn't work at all. It doesn't have to do with like a certain number of steps I have. It has